Time for Christmas, and all through the street, the cop's shatter interrupts the sound of my feet. I'm stopped by a young cop at the edge of my crime scene. Who are you? asks a young man, all too keen. Detective Wayne Walker, I growl. The young man lets me true with a frowl. I lift up a sheet that covers the body. A grandmother lies dead, I suspect a hit and run. Probably someone who drank too much Christmas fun. But the hoof prints around her suggest an animal attack. With a shiver up my spine, I whisper. He's back. The young cop asks, Detective Walker, what do you say? I take a drag on my fag. I suspect foul play. I specialize in Christmas crimes. I tell the young cop's face. This is Ho Ho Homicide, and I'm on the case. The cold snow melts into my shoes, making me feel my age. The people are tucked in their beds with their shopping all done, leaving the streets deserted like an empty stage. Paying no mind to the P.I. and his gun. Something tells me Favreau's bar is the place to be. I walk into the joint when who do I see? But Elfo, the creatively named Elf, in his usual boot. I order us around from the bartender, missing a toot. That mistletoe I can smell even smoking, Alpha. Jeez, Walker. You, you, your hairline's moving back to meet your ass. Have you been, Alpha? I haven't seen you since... Since Mike's funeral. Oh, jeez, yeah. I miss him every day. The three of us used to be like brothers, remember? Well, that's... It's because me and Mike were brothers, Alpha. Ah, yeah. Hey, 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 fellas. Here you go. Two hot chocolates. Oh jeez, Wayne, you didn't you didn't have to do this here. Let, let me get to the, Nah, nah, it's all right. Hey, hey, Rooney, what? No marshmallows? Hey, hey, Walker, relax. You know I've got some uh, special imported South Pole marshmallows. From my friend, if you know what I mean. Maybe you and I could. Nah, nah, I can't tonight, Alpha. I'm working on a case. <laughs> You've changed, but we ain't eight anymore. You're telling me. Anyway, uh, listen, this case, it's, I think it might have something to do with your old boss. Oh, I, I ain't getting involved with that psycho ever again. Come on, Alpho. I really think I can catch him. And so with the info I got from Alpho, I knew Calvin's penthouse was the place to go. I picked the lock and hid by the fire escape ladder. But from the lounge, I rose such a clatter. I saw him pillage so nimble and quick. I knew in that moment it must be St. Nick. I pulled out my gun and bellowed out from my jaws. Drop the bag and put your hands up, claws! <laughs> Wayne Walker, what are you doing up so late on Christmas Eve? He asked like a man who hadn't met his fate. And suddenly he shot up the chimney like a spring. He was moving at the speed of a fast thing. I knew I had plenty of proof for them to lock him away. I raced to the roof and found him on a sleigh. He sat ready to take flight. Freeze, Santa! This ends tonight! Ha <laughs> ha! You know, it's funny! That's exactly what I heard all those years ago! That's nice! But I killed your brother! And that's when I came back, the anger and the pain. My brother's killer had a name, and it was Santa. into his silken sack. He pulled out a minigun, ready to attack. Then I saw an image, so humble, the jolly man began to stumble. You see, I'd slipped South Pole marshmallows into his cocoa. Now, center of gravity was going loco. And as I saw him near the edge, I decided to quit. Hey, big man. Have a nice trip. And as I saw the killer fall, and he lost all of his might, I whispered, Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night.